Blake Man. Play New Gundam Breaker. Yeah. Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, Piv Squeak. And I'm Gundam Man. And we're back playing New Gundam Breaker. And uh, Blake Man's gonna take the the helm with these other two ladies. Yep. One that looks like her friend Alicia. Yep. And the other one, we have no idea who she is because we never met her in the game. So I recommended. Um, I recommended that Alicia uh, check out Leonardo da Vinci, the, that one I sent you from Kate. Oh god, the glob. <laughs> We're like, oh god, she's gonna break Call our neck with her Call me Chi cheeks. Nuts. Really? Chi Nuts? Why not D's Nuts? Also, I like how she's standing on the back of the heels of her shoes. Uh, she's not standing. If you look, that's the door next to us. No, no, I'm not saying standing. I meant like, you know, when people sometimes put their feet in their shoes and they sometimes stand up. Oh, like that. Yeah, I see. Yeah. No, you're right. Yeah, it's she is. It's either that or she has weird slipper things. No, 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 you're right. She's she's definitely standing on the back. I guess it's part of like her whole characterization as a Genki. I don't, I don't understand anything that's going on. But we need to show this to Alicia. Good God. Good God. It's just so like easy to take this as innuendo. Good Lord. It's like she's going for the innuendo. Think, what the fuck? I think that's uh, uh, do, you, do you gun dazzle yourself? I want to know I now want to see a, uh, someone who made a gun pawn actually bedazzle it. I mean, that's got to be a thing. This is the part where you, while you're editing, like cut cut the video, pause it real quick, yeah, and insert like a couple frames of a Gundam that's been bedazzled. <laughs> I'm looking up now. <coughs> Excuse me. Do you even see if that's a thing? I really hope she doesn't go, wow, it's so big. <laughs> it's a little light on decoration, but I guess it's pretty okay in that cool dashing way. People at home, just wait till you see the Gundam I spent the better part of the last 20 minutes making. Oh my god, it is a thing. <laughs> yeah, did you not? Did, they bedazzle everything. You did really think that... Oh my god, I'm gonna try to see if I can put some of these in. Yeah. <laughs> just make sure that you give proper... Oh, good lord. It's amazing! Good lord. Just make sure that you credit the people that you take these pictures from. Oh my god. Oh hey, no, I, I wasn't even paying attention. Oh, right, it's QT Max Gundam. Yeah, because she's cute. To the max! Yeah. Oh, I'm getting a headache. <laughs> Behold! Oh my god, this is actually amazing. Look at that! Oh, see, that's the cool part about Gian. Gian Gundam, uh, the Gian Gundam, Gian Mobile Suits are basically built to look like knights. Well, that that is kind of the whole shtick. Yeah, they're knights with missile launchers mounted in their shields. Hey, uh, look, a Gian with a, with a missile launchers mounted in its shields. Yeah, but it's a custom build. Dude, so you know what I found? Uh, you've probably seen it before because you're Gundam Build Fighters fan, but oh, I saw yeah. someone made a Shenlong Gundam the, like they have a kit for a Shenlong Gundam from Build Fighters, where he's, in, in, he's got the dragons, right? But, uh, I, oh yeah, right here, cutie's got a bow. Yeah, but can we have that bow? No, I don't think so. Cause it's probably not a standard piece of equipment. I mean, Bear Guy gets a bow. So that's true. Maybe it's a Bear Guy. Maybe that's my Bear Guy. I want that. That's Bear Guy's backpack. Is a fucking bow. I bet. Oh wait, no, that's a that's a Gundam builder part. Cause see, it's attached to her backpack. I don't care what it is, we need it. But, uh... Shit, what was I saying before that? I, I don't... I don't know. Her gun is horribly distracted. Right? It's so cute! It's so, like, bubblegum colors. I like how the bow seems like a different paint style. Than the rest of I like how sometimes his backpack lets me fly the same way that, uh... uh that the other, the other one does. Only it's way less ugly looking. Really that really god awful one that was like a, an array of jets and wings on the back, not even including the hilariously oversized uh, rocket boosters I put on it. You usually do take off all your little extra accessories. Yeah, that's true. I should take off mine because I feel like they're. Yours do actually increase your performance. They just come with downsides as well. Yeah, well, I mean, the only thing is they're really distracting. You can't see me. Yeah, them yeah that's true. Really I fucking love my new Gundam. Oh, that's right. Um, so there was a, there, there's a Build Fighters high grade kit. It's it's a Shenlong Build Fighters Gundam. So it's got Shenlong's uh, dragon fist things, right? 
um, but they're attached to a wolf and a lion shoulder pad, so he looks fucking sweet. I want to get it so bad. I wonder if that's part of the new Genesis series. Uh, Maybe. Because I don't remember that out of watching two seasons, and yeah. I know a third season's come out. So, I need yeah. to check it out. There's also the Gundam Breaker. But, uh, yeah, I saw it. It was fucking sweet. I wanted to buy it and send it to my uncle, because the first Gundam he ever bought me was a Shenmue 1-1-3 scale. Which is interesting, because out of all the Wing Gundam model kits, that's yeah. the only one I'm missing. Is... Shenmue. Oh, when you said Wing Gundam, I was I was thinking actual Wing Gundam versions. Well, the, well because we have Wing Gundam. Yeah. We have two different versions of Wing Gundam, specifically. Yeah. And we have... Then you also have Wing Zero. Uh, or yes. are you counting that as one of the two versions you have? Because I thought you had two different... I thought you had uh, Wing Gundam Kai and... Uh, Wing I Gundam. have her Kai, yeah, but he's Master Grade. Yeah. And then we also have um, Wing Gundam Custom on the Feather Wings. So yeah. That's a hybrid. Uh, I don't think that's off. I think that he's still kind of in the works. Uh, but we have... What Gundams do you have that aren't? Let's be real here. You've got like 400 Gundams and 20 of them. Oh. You have a literal closet sitting right next to us right now that is full of Gundams that have not been completed. I, I need to get, uh, I have a real grade, uh, double O riser that's fully done and painted. He yeah. just needs to just be taken out of his box and put on the shelf. Yeah. He's, really he's just kind of sitting in there. He needs to join, uh, Axia at his side. But, um. So, so yeah, we have Wing Gundam. We have Sand Rock, we have Heavy Arms, we have Tall Geese. Yep. I think we have actually two out of three versions of Tall Geese as well. Well, to be fair, there are three Tall Geese. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I think we have Tall Geese from one and three. Dude, I fucking love two and three. Two is pretty and then good. And we also have Death Song. Really so the only one we're missing out of. Because we also have Epion, which is just been two bits. Because he was a Christmas person. Unfortunately, he's a real Epion and not the non grade Epion that came out in the 90s. Oh no, he's Master Grade. He's a bit expensive because he can also transform. Yeah. Got him with shiny fingers. Thank you. And then, uh. Yeah. So I'll let you know whenever the Chief Deploy thing happens. I want to know what happens. If you trust me. Oh, the uh, IF deployed. Yeah, I'm gonna say IF deployed. So if this is deployed, you might want to actually target that. You make it a little easier. <laughs> no, dude, the fucking targeting in this game sucks. I'm not saying it's you know not. The, you I'm know what the biggest saying. problem with the targeting in this game is? It's the fact that on top of, um, like, I can understand it being, you know, target whoever, but it targets not who you're looking at with the camera, it targets, or it targets who you're looking at with the camera, not who your gun is facing and thus beating up on. Which is really annoying when you want to just beat the it hell out of somebody. It also doesn't help that when you try to turn the camera and make it easier to see where you're going. You have to take your hands off the attack button. Not even that. The, the issue I have is it changes the target. Oh yeah, that, that sucks too. That's the more annoying thing where it's like... Gundam is a pretty slow uh, pick attack. That yeah, was cool. I just I wasn't telling you to get out. That's why. Yeah, you might want to deposit. Yeah. Then we've got some, uh, Oh, that's a bear guy! <gasps> that is a bear guy! Oh my god, we gotta go beat him. his ass! <laughs> Where you at? Come here, bear guy! Get him. No, not that asshole! <laughs> bear guy! We got his bow! We Yay. got his bow! <laughs> Alright, we need to go get the. We need to deposit this shit right for fucking nap. Well, because it's uh, key part anyway. Yeah. But still, I like how we're talking. There better be a bear guy. It's like, and there's sure a fucking enough, bear guy! There's a bear guy! And he dropped one of the only two parts of him that we actually want. The other being his face. Yeah. So that we can have fucking bear guy head on our uh, on our fucking Gundam bodies. We can put it on Pipsy. Nah, Pipsy don't need it. Pipsy don't play that way. There it is. Yep, and there's a nice table on the way. Yep. Yeah. Oh, you got your if deployed. You got yeah. your R1 and triangle, so. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, bullshit! I'm literally depositing it right now. Fucking timer. Okay, we still have the part though. Yes. So, so you know what this is? This is a it, it blocks incoming gunfire. Ooh. Yeah. Because that's the thing that that unicorn deploys when it goes into transformation, where it takes control of all pin funnels and redirects uh, gunfire. Pin funnel. Oh, Which, you motherfucker! You going down now? If anyone knows of any uh, gun of the pin funnels are literally the most broken thing in the entire. Game. No funnel bits are worse. 
anything is fun. Funnel bits are the worst thing, but that's what Krubly has. Especially when you have a uh, new type pilot who oh, can God, control yeah. them with their mind while also piloting their normal Gundam all at once. Yeah. People give a lot of shit to G Gundam for how quote unquote unreasonable and unrealistic it seems, but like that shit is the real bullshit. You gotta defeat the new Gundam. <laughs> I would recover the key part at least first, just to yeah. kind of boost up your points so you can get closer to having So, Denobrium is the green square? I think so. That or he's that weird triangle thing going bleep bleep Because I think the weird triangle thing went, Oh no, the weird triangle thing going bleep bleep is telling me how to get to him. Oh, well, that was nice. It's the I'm, I'm glad it tells us now, not on the yeah. mission when we first were on this map. And before someone fucking cuts to the other video and it's like, oh look, it's totally telling us where to go. Maybe? I'm trying to figure out how to... Oh, because it's this one up here. Okay, okay. Hey, look, the key part. It looks like a pair of gun cannon legs. It's, it is. it's a pair of gun cannon legs. Great. Um, it's down in the same location where yep. it was last time. I do like the look of when you boost. Yeah, how nice. Everything is just all blue and like... Dude, Sinanju has a sweet fucking design. Pretty much every element is Too on the fucking point. He's not evil. Science isn't evil or good. It's how you use it. Like the death ray. Who does Sinanju face against? He faces Unicorn. Does he? Yeah, he faces Unicorn and he allies with Kishatria and uh, Rosin I guess that makes sense. Because the only thing he's piloted by full frontal. Because I keep remembering from the, the movie where um, Unicorn fights. No. Unicorn does fight Kishatria. No, no, no. I, 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 for some reason, I always get. Unicorn and Gundam stuff. Oh, <laughs> you were thinking of a fucking Z Gundam, weren't you? No, I was thinking of Sazabi uh, that um, Unicorn fights. I know, the, the series. Oh, you're thinking of Char's counterattack? Yes. Okay. Oh, it's right here, that's why. It's the, I'm trying to find the ramp, I couldn't find the fucking ramp. Alright. I hate the whole quest for Golden Cannon. We've never seen one. This so, what the hell? I get places to be, motherfuckers. How the. Oh, because it's. No, I remember the ping is over here. It's somewhere over here. It's where we need. Unless this is where the fucking Ben King lives, right? I don't know. I don't, I, don't know. Know. I don't fucking know how to get up there. Yeah, probably good will do me when you fucking lose me. Yeah, none of the Vert teleporters are working at the moment. I yeah. know. And we know where he is. Yeah. And we know that there's supposed to be teleporters that works right above. Hey, there's another little thing you can do today. Oh, there is. Uh, no, that's that's probably uh, recover the key part. Oh, I mean, you might have not looked at it. Yeah, because see, it's Johnny Ritten. Yeah, see, it's oh, right there. Okay, well, that, that's recover cool. Johnny Ritten's bits. But how do we get up to the... None of the teleporters are working. Maybe there's a launcher? I know there's a launcher into the base. Yeah, I'm gonna fucking lose this fucking game, because, like, I can't... I hate this fucking map. This map is awful. Like, how the fuck am I supposed to get up there? Oh, I mean, to be honest. We had a teleporter. For some reason, the teleporter isn't active and yeah. doesn't want to work. None of these fucking teleporters are working. How are we supposed to fight the Doombrium if we can't get to him? Yeah. Game, okay. explain yourself. On the plus side, we got the only part we really care about, which is that guy's bow. Or his bear guy's bow. So we can at least, you know, take the bear guy bow with us. And we'll only get three, but that's got to be one of them. Mm -hmm. That's really frustrating. Like, what the fuck are we supposed to fucking do? Oh. Lonely, you helped us! Yeah, she couldn't figure out how to fucking get there either. I love how the AI are so smart, except for the moment when the game decides to not do anything right. Yeah. And the game's like, I'm not gonna help you. Yeah. Alright, yeah, I know, I lost. What do you fucking do? Okay. Alright, so. I think those are all broken. How do I? Oh, toggle check. There we go. Uh, that's what we want. Yeah, Bear Guy 3. Alright, so we're getting Bear Guy's bow, obviously. Uh, Beam Sword X. I mean, 
that cool? I thought we already had gun tank legs. No, we don't, because oh, well, if taking, other, otherwise it would be X. We're out. taking the gun tank That's legs. That's fine. Uh, Should we get Act Guys on just to go along with the Bear Guys? Does yeah, mean? I feel like, yeah. Yeah. We now have a bow! Yeah, so we can put totally, a bow on. I totally told you it was a part. Yeah, we can put a bow on somebody. Oh my god. You gonna put a bow on yours? No. Watch it give you like a, it gives you an EX skill. No, it just gives you invincibility and you win at everything. It's like motherfucker. All right, so that was fucking stupid. That took forever and we got fucked, so. Well, we got a bear guy bow, so. Yeah, so we'll, Silver lining. We'll see you guys next time. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell if you want to see more from us. And we'll catch you next time. Bye. Bye.